World Vision is here in Baxka. Um, we run a child-friendly space uh, for children and a breastfeeding space for mothers with young infants. Um, and this is an unofficial border crossing, if I can put it that way. Cheese! A child-friendly space is a place uh, where children and mothers can come in to take a rest. There is some normalcy um, in the midst of a very difficult situation. Uh, we are here to provide psychosocial support. We have psychologists on staff. Um, we have public health uh, officers on staff that can help mothers with breastfeeding. Um, we encourage moms to continue to breastfeed, uh, even though it's a very difficult time in this journey for them. Um, and also, uh, it's a place where we identify separated and unaccompanied children, and then we try to help them um, through coordination with the Red Cross and when HCR to reunify with their families. Especially when the borders closes, uh, we have a lot of separated cases. Um, in a day, we can see up to about five separated cases um, of children as young as three um, to as old as 14 years old. Um, so it's actually fairly common that in the midst of chaos, that parents think that their child is with another parent uh, and assume that um, somebody is watching over them, but in actuality, the child has been separated from the family. We have a lot of um, mothers with very young babies, uh, so we're talking about babies as young as eight days old. Um, and today we have a baby that is only a day old um, that has come through CFS. So um, in a lot of ways, I think it's a very much needed service that nobody else is providing. We're the only child focus agency um, in Baxka that's doing this right now. This baby cross the sea. <laughs> If the border is closed, then parents will try to seek a place for their child to sleep in um, that's warm. And our CFS not only is a place where they can play, um, there's a generator, there's a radiator, so it's warm and people can seek shelter at night um, when the border is closed. I love what we do here because our services is very unique. I, I love the fact that we get to help um, people that uh, are really in need, uh, especially children who are voiceless, uh, mothers who are desperate, um, families who really just want to stay together. And I think that um, it's very fulfilling work that you can be here to be that happiness for the little child, you know, to be able to see them learn. Um, calming techniques uh, and see them play with toys that they haven't seen for three weeks, four weeks, um, create that normalcy in their lives. I, I think it's, it's really fulfilling to be able to be there for somebody when they most need it. Um, and, and you can't ask for more for, for a job like that. Mm. <laughs>